Hello and welcome back everyone to another exciting episode of Toucan Plays. In this ultimate guide, we are going to go over all of the locations for all of the crazy creatures. We're going to start off here in Camp Crushmore. The first crazy creature is found right here. Here's the X. Right in this spot right here. You just kind of hang out on the X for long enough, and eventually, there it is, Crush Station. That's a cool truck. After you unlock Crush Station, you come back to the garage, and you switch out over to Crush Station. You can see on the map here, as we drive up to it, you can see that there's this amphitheater, and in the middle of it is a triangle. So where this amphitheater is, around the back side it's past all these camper stations over here and here is the amphitheater right here you just park crush station right in the middle of the amphitheater you wait a little while and bam there is crush stations secret world collectible now for the next crazy creature we're gonna move over here to the bark park in the bark park you can see on the map we've got this eight-legged octopus and there's a lake in the shape of the number eight <laughs> get it eight octanate or <laughs> that's the truck that we're gonna unlock i'm gonna take sparkle smash over to that figure eight lake and I'll tell you how to unlock Sparkle Smash later. But for Octonator, what you want to do is you want to go past this Dalmatian doghouse over here. And we're going to just kind of drive right up this hill. Vroom! And there is the figure eight lake. And there is the X that marks the spot of the figure eight lake. We just sit on that for a little while. And we unlock Octonator. Very cool. And if you look over here to the map, you can see that there's these archways. And there's actually four of them. If you look really close, that there's two of them inside that one over there. <laughs> I'll just crash into it. But anyway, we were looking for... The one on the far end of the racetrack. It's over this way. I'll show you. Okay, so here's the racetrack and here are the archways. And we're looking for the one on the far end all the way over here. There it is. Okay, so for the next crazy creature, we want to come over here to the highlands. Oh, no. Oh, jeez. Sparkle Spash took a nosedive. But if you make your way over to the garage, you can see the map right here. We've got a Triceratops, and there's only one truck that looks like a Triceratops, and that's Jurassic Attack. And then you've got this, this archway that looks a lot like the archway from Jurassic Park. And it looks like the X is on the other side of that archway. So we need to find that archway. Where you're going to find that is off this side. Wee! Drive off this way. Take out a few trees. And here it is, right here. That is the Jurassic Park archway. And then right on the other side of the Jurassic Park archway, X marks the spot. There's Jurassic Attack. Now, in order to get back to the garage quickly, what you can do is you can go in here to single player, go down to quick play, and pick any any event, doesn't matter what you pick. Because all, it doesn't matter what truck you pick either, because all we're gonna do is we're gonna quit immediately after. Once it loads, we just push start, quit event. And we end up getting teleported right back to where we started 
at the garage. Once we're here at the garage, we're going to change over to Jurassic Attack. And if we look at the map, you can see there's another big gate and a big sci-fi looking building and some kind of a weird scanner and or lamp. I don't know, some kind of weird thing, but that's where his Secret World Collectible is. Over the bridge. And here is that big sci-fi building right there. And the lamp is right next to it. It's a street lamp. Oh, there we go. Okay, so for the next crazy creature, we're going to come over here to the wasteland. Alright, so over here by the garage, you can see that there's a big dragon in the sky. That's because we unlocked dragon in the wasteland. And the X is marked on a sand dune out in the desert. And we're going to cruise around the sand dunes. So it's not this first big sand dune over here. It's this sand dune right next to it. And it's kind of, it kind of sneaks up on you a little bit, but there it is right there. Okay, and once we've unlocked Dragon, his Secret World Collectible is out in front of an airplane. To find it, we need to come up over here to this freeway off to the right. Here's the exit gate. We're going to take a left, though. And here is the big airplane. We're going to drive right up the middle of it, and we're going to boost. Wee! Oof. <laughs> Went too far. Once we get on the other side, there's the airplane right over there. We're going to come down into this little valley, and here are our three cactuses all in a row. Just kind of drive right in the middle of them all. Breathe some fire, light up the trees. <laughs> and there is our secret collectible. Okay, and for our final crazy creature unlock, we're here in the Haunted Forest, and it is a shark. That's got to be Megalodon. And Megalodon, it looks like there's an X kind of over by where there's some ship parts and a crack in the wall and a bunch of trees. This one's a little obscure, trying to, kind of hard to find, to be honest. Okay, so we're out here in the swamp, and there is this ship right here. This is actually where you find Pirate's Curse's Secret World Collectible. If we come around this side, though, we can see there is a ship's mast. And there's a few other things right over here. And there's the, that wall or that uh, cliff that's kind of cracked in the middle. So right over here is actually right where the X is. Here it is on the ground right here. Like usual, we just kind of sit here and wait for a minute. And there is Megalodon! Alright, now that we have Megalodon unlocked, we can come over here to the map. And we see, like, there's these four obelisks, the, the kind of pyramid-y looking things. And there's a bunch of little squares and a weird building in the middle of it all. The way we find that is we kind of come around this way. And we go down this ramp. And this is all behind the castle. And when we turn to the right, though, over here, there's obelisks, and there's the rectangles, and there is the one right in the middle, right there. This is where Megalodon's Secret World Collectible is. There it is. Okay, now, I told you that I would explain how to get Sparkle Smash later. Well, it's later. So how to get Sparkle Smash is you have to get 25,000 XP in the Crazy Creatures group. So it doesn't matter who you level up. It could be any of these Crazy Creatures. But you got to level up one of them in order to get 25,000 XP. I happen to work on Dragon, uh, and I got him to max level, and that got me the 25,000 XP I needed to unlock Sparkle Smash. In the process of leveling up Dragon, at level 14, 
I also unlocked a color variant of Dragon, Dragon Overcast. And that looks really cool. I love Dragon Overcast. Kind of black and white and gray with the orange highlights. It's a really nice truck. Now, we're going to take Sparkle Smash and we're going to go find Sparkle Smash World's Secret World Collectible. Okay, now if you didn't know already, all of the open world areas are connected kind of like a big donut. So we're going from the Haunted Forest and we're heading back in through this cave into Camp Crushmore. And here we are back in Camp Crushmore. Whee! Okay, so now to get the Hidden World Collectible for Sparkle Smash, you can see this rainbow that's over the lake over here. That's your clue. You come up to the end of this dock and you get like a little rainbow bridge. It's so nice. <laughs> feel like I'm playing Mario Kart on the rainbow road. Drive through the little rainbow portal. Woohoo! And there is Sparkle Smash's secret world collectible. Okay, and then every time I'm here in Camp Crushmore, I always have to knock out this water tower just because it's so much fun. Whoa, got it. <laughs> All right, I hope you enjoyed this ultimate guide to the crazy creature unlocks. Leave a comment below and let me know what you would like to see an ultimate guide for in Steel Titans 2 next. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the flip side. Later.